guys hope you're doing great our today's question is merge two binary trees given two binary trees and imagine that when you put one on top one of them to cover the other some nodes of the two trees are overlapped while the others are not you need to merge them into a new binary tree the merge rule is that if two nodes overlap then some node values up as the new value of the merged node otherwise the not null node will be used as the node of the new tree so for example here, this is the tree 1 and 2. And if we basically place the tree 2 on top of tree 1, right? So wherever there are or wherever there are positions where there is an overlap between two nodes, so that new node will be the sum of the two nodes that are being merged. And if there's only a single node, then just that node comes out as the value of the merge tree. So if you see here when 2 is placed on top of 1, the sum is 3. When 3 and 1 are combined, the sum is 4. Here, 2 plus 3 is 5. But for example, since here uh, the right child of 3 is uh, null, whereas the right child of 1 is 4, so the final value is 4. Right? The merging process must start from the root nodes of both trees. Okay. So, um, here clearly we need to, if, if you think about the approach that we should take to solve this question. So, for trees we have either recursion or we do some sort of a traversal. Um, <clears throat> the naive approach would be that we traverse both the nodes, uh, create maybe a level order traversal, keeping nulls in place and then just using those two arrays, summing them up, them up and then uh, creating a tree out of that but that would definitely not be a very good solution um, so let's think about how we can solve it recursively so for every node we just need to understand that the other tree has a node at this point right at it at this position if yes then we create a new node with the sum value of those other nodes uh, those two nodes and then the left of that new node would be the sum of the left of both these current nodes that we are processing and the right would be the sum of the right nodes right um, if both of them are null then it's a null if either of them is a null then we have to basically just return the non-null for the merge tree right so keeping that in mind we can just apply a very simple recursive algorithm to solve this question so let's get started Okay, all right, so we'll just implement the function. Um, let's say we just have, don't even need to initialize. We'll just return, let's call it merge and we provided T1 and T2. Okay, now let's implement this. So this will be Tree node T1 comma tree node sorry, tree node T2. Okay, fine. So as I was saying, if let's have some base conditions taken care of first of all. So if T1 is equal to null and T2 is equal to null as well, then we just have to return a null. Right. If t1 is equal to null and t2 is not equal to null, then we just have to return t2 because that's not null and that will be the only merged object. Similarly, if t1 is not equal to null but t2 is, right? Then we just return t1. Okay. So if none of these conditions is true, it means that we have two valid nodes which have got some values in them. So what we'll do is we'll just create a new node called sum, which will be the which will have value equal to the sum of the values in both t1 and t2. So we'll just do a 
summation here. Well, yeah, right. Uh, and talking about the left and the right, so the left child of this node would be the merged value of t1 dot left and t2 dot left. And similarly, the right child of this would be a merged value of t1 dot right and t2 dot right. Okay. And we just have to return some after this. Yeah. Looks good. So uh, let's try to run this. Okay. Fine, it works. So the time complexity is O of n because we are just traversing both the trees once. And the space complexity is O of n as well because of recursion. So the recursion stack has a space complexity equal to the number of objects or elements that we are um, working on. So it's O of n as well. So I hope you guys find this video helpful. If you do, please like, share and subscribe. Keep coding and take care guys.